Now, this is pretty bizarre. All of a sudden, while they're contesting the race, out on the track comes a skunk, like and is in a rodent. And as you can see in the video right there, take a look. You See the video? See, yes. see the skunk? Yes. You do see the skunk. <laughs> well, I kind of. Kind of see the skunk? <laughs> well, there's a skunk. Anyway, the whole thing, well, the crazy thing was Andy Miller's horse made a break and the skunk spewed all kinds of stuff. And the guy who took the brunt of it was driver Corey Callahan, who did have a change of clothes but did not have a change of helmets. So he had to continue with the rest of the night smelling like a skunk. And our Charlotte caught up with him to find out what happened. Thanks, guys. I'm here with two drivers, Corey Callahan, Andy Miller. We're going to start with you, Andy. We're going to talk about the fifth race last Friday at the Meadowlands. What went down? Uh, we're going in the first turn, and I uh, look out in, on the middle of the track there, and there's a skunk there. So uh, I, we're already into the race, so there's nothing to do. And about uh, halfway through the turn there, the skunk decides to head back in front of us and uh, come right into the middle of the race. And my horse jumped it, and then my wheel went over it, and the skunk hit it right through the middle of the pack. Now, were you unscathed? Yeah, other than the horse making a break and not having any chance, uh, it didn't bother me. So you were the lucky one. You were the unlucky one. Tell us where you were when the skunk happened. Yeah, I was, uh, I think, fourth on the rail. Um, Campbell was third on the rail. We were the two that kind of got it the worst. You know, I mean, I, I don't really know what happened. I, I saw his horse, like, veering away from the skunk, and then I looked down, you know, and, like, my horse was going over top of it. So, um you know, it was it was funny, like, after we finished the mile, I was like, oh, my God, do you smell that? You know what I mean? Well, I thought everything was going to be fine. We went back in the paddock, and I'm like, it's not going away, you know? And I'm, I'm smelling myself and everything. And so I had to drive a couple races that way. Um, and then I went up and took a shower, and I thought everything was fine. And it was still there. It was all over my helmet. It was stuck, like, in this leather right here. And it, I, I mean, Roxanne's doing a really good job of getting it out with all these home remedies so hopefully it's okay by this weekend good stuff huh really yeah. good stuff amazing i didn't even notice that cory smelled bad well cory noticed yeah. <laughs> that was the important